Are you looking for the best 3D printers? In this video, we will look at some of the best 3D printers on the market. Before we get started with our video, we have included links in the description. So make sure you check those out to see which one is in your budget range. Starting at number 1. Dremel DG Lab 3D45 3D Printer. As a small business owner or a professional looking to use a 3D printer, the Dremel DEG Lab 3D45 3D Printer will offer you good value for money. This tool is great. However, it might be less good for you if you are looking to use a 3D printer on a commercial level given its limited size. Although this firm is not the most popular for its 3D printers, it is known for its high level of craftsmanship, and this 3D printer is a product of such craftsmanship. Furthermore, this printer already has a reputation for churning out prints of high quality. The Dremel DG Lab 3D45 3D printer features a close frame, ensuring that users do not get in harm's way while it works. Additionally, you can print from a USB thumb drive, Wi-Fi connection, or Ethernet. It also features an HD built-in camera, enabling remote print monitoring. In terms of build dimensions, the Dremel offers 6.7x 10x 6 170 by 254 by 152 mm. At number 2. Ultimaker S5. Ultimaker S5 is not one of the cheapest 3D printers in the market. It is quite expensive. While this could look like a drawback, it actually offers you good value for money and comes with several premium features, notably a heated bed allowing for smoother prints. The S5 is a 3D printer for pros and is particularly good for people looking to print large objects, with build dimensions of 330 by 240 by 300 mm. So if you want to get a printer for large prototypes, this is a serious contender. This printer also has a closed frame to help minimize contaminants like dust. It also comes with dual extruders, making it possible for you to print two filament types, while it supports filaments including PLA, Tough PLA, Nylon ABS, PBA, and TPU. This device was designed for pros. However, setting it up and operating it is very easy. At Number 3. MakerBot Replicator Plus. With the MakerBot Replicator Plus comes a good number of connectivity alternatives. So, it is up to you how exactly you want to print. Also, you can choose to print from a computer. If this is the route you want to take, you can print from Wi-Fi, Ethernet, or USB. Also, you can print from a tablet or phone with the MakerBot app. There is more. This 3D printer has its software, which can be adjusted to suit whoever uses it. This printer is an open frame device. However, this is not a problem as its external nozzle is behind the extruder assembly and is difficult to get to, so there is a little bit of protection rather than it being fully exposed. This printer is a good choice for the hobbyist, and we say that considering it has build dimensions of approximately 295 by 195 by 165 mm, 11.6 by 7.6 by 6.5 in. The modest area means miniatures are a sensible focus for this 3D printer too. At Number 4. Biku B1 FDM 3D Printer. Supporting multiple languages via its TFT touchscreen, the Biku B1 utilizes a variety of advanced technology to deliver an FDM, fused deposition modeling, printer you won't regret investing in. A variety of FDM printers are available, but for our money, its very own magnetic patch allows for easy removal of models every single time. One exceptionally cool feature is that in the event of a power outage, the last recorded extruder position will be assumed and printing will resume right from where you were, minimizing waste and saving you time starting from scratch. On the downside, the Biku B1 doesn't have an automatic bed, instead, it has a manual bed so should you want auto-leveling, you'd be out of luck. At Number 5. Anycubic Photon Mono X 3D Printer. Three times faster than its counterparts, the Anycubic Photon Mono X takes just one second for single-layer exposure, with a maximum printing speed of 60 mm per second, ready to bring you the highest quality models in half the time of competing products. The high throughput and build volume is certainly a plus point. An ultra-high resolution, app remote control, and a large printing volume are just some of its impressive key features, expect to spend more on this bad boy and in return experience some of the best and brightest models ever printed at home. 
In terms of build dimensions, the Photon Mono X is 192 by 120 by 245 mm, 7.5 by 4.7 by 9.8 in. This makes it another 3D printer for anyone looking to focus on miniatures.